I can't tell if I'm in focus or not, so let's just hope that I am. It's too far away. It looks fine to me, so. Hey guys, it's Annika. Welcome to my Chaka. So, ooh, that actually felt really good. I need to stretch. Oh my god, wait. Why does that feel so good? Okay. So, today I'm going to be finally doing my What I Got For Christmas video. It's January 10th. Christmas was 16 days ago, over two weeks ago, and I'm out here! <laughs> I've been too busy making TikToks. I'm so sorry. Please go follow me. My reason for putting it off for so long was because I wanted to get all my gifts from my friends so that I could show you guys, but all my friends forgot that they had Christmas presents for me, and I'm not gonna... I don't need gifts, but I kind of just wanted to get this video over with so that's why I wanted them That sounds really fucking bitchy <laughs> I don't know how to put it in a not bitchy way Y'all know me and I'm so grateful that my parents, mostly my mom, decided to get all this for me It made me really happy and I'm really grateful for the friends that have given me their gifts so far And I'm grateful for the friends that even considered getting me a gift because I don't really need a gift It's just the thought that counts So let's get poppin' I got another bag because I use bags for school This is the one that I was using before, it's a Fila bag, it's from Urban Outfit there's nothing wrong with it. It's actually a really nice bag. It has like a pocket here But I just wanted a different one especially a black one because it's just more neutral and I saw this one I really liked it. It's a cap bag and I like this one a lot because it actually has a zip at the top That one's just more of like a tote bag. This one is like I feel a book bag or a computer bag It's way bigger than the other one. At least it feels like it. Maybe it's just because it has like Width? I don't know. So yeah, I'm really happy that I got that. I also got this set of Ariana Grande perfumes. I'm super excited about this because I've heard so many great things about the Ariana Grande perfumes, but I didn't know which one I wanted. Last time I checked, she only had one. But you get the bitch, like, I know their names. Oh, it says on the back. Ari by Ariana Grande. I'm guessing that's the solid pink one. Sweet Like Candy is that one. Then Cloud, I know that. Moonlight, yeah, that's definitely Moonlight. And that's Sweet Like Candy. I'm so excited about this. They're just, like, mini bottles. They don't have, like, a spritzer or a roller. They're just kind of one of those ones with an open top, and you just stab it. I think it's fine. I don't really care. I'm just excited that I have them. I smell really good now. Like, that's kind of lit. Here's a gift that actually surprised me. It was from my dad. And my dad, either last year or two years ago, he got me a word of the day calendar. Those are the kind of gifts that my dad gives. He likes to give books. Um, he's one of those hoes. But this year, he got me this necklace from Anthropology, which he scratched out the price because he's that kind of man. But I'm pretty sure it was like wicked expensive, but I literally am in love with it. I saw it in the store when we were shopping together and I, I nutted basically. And he witnessed my nut and he got it for me. When I left the store to get a gift for somebody else, he got this for me. It's so sweet. I really appreciate that. Like I was shook when I open that. Moving on. I got an iPhone charging case. At first I was kind of frustrated with it because I was like, you can't choose when you charge your phone with it. There's no like button to activate it, if you will, turn it on. It's just always charging your phone if it's charged. And that was kind of annoying at first because I was like, if my phone is at 100, then it's just going to like keep it at 100. Then I'm not going to have it if I need it. But the fact of the matter is I was just being a fucking dumb bitch. I was drinking too much dumb bitch juice because at the end of the day, you still get the same amount of battery. You still have like 200% battery if you have a charged phone in this case. So I found that like I literally go to school, I come home, it's been a full day at school, my phone's at 92%. Like it charged for the whole day. I love this case. It is really helpful. It's kind of a lifesaver. You never have to worry about your phone dying. It's kind of whack. I don't know how she got me this palette because Too Faced sold it for like three seconds. I don't even know. It did break. One of the shadows did break, but it's kind of an ugly shadow, so I don't really care. But I do need to clean it up. But she got me the Gingerbread Spice palette, which I don't know how she got because Too Faced, I don't even know what happened to it. It was this one that broke. There's still like a little bit left. I don't even care, bro. This is such a cute palette. I was really upset when I found out that Too Faced stopped selling it because I put it on my Christmas list and I was like, oh, I'm not going to get it. But then I got it. I just wanted it for the shade Gumdrop alone, which is that one. It's not so fucking beautiful. <laughs> One of the shades is called Looky at My Cookie. That's sexual and I don't like it. Maybe. Maybe it's not sexual. Maybe she just wants him to look at her cookie. Okay, so the only friend gift that I have at the moment is MC. She kind of went off. So first she got me two jewelry items from Dolls Kill. First she got me this necklace. It's so pretty. I actually wear it every day. I'm not wearing it today because I wanted to like do a specific necklace for this outfit. But when I'm not wearing another necklace, I wear this all the time. I wear it to sleep when I shower. It's just a gold heart on like a silver chain and I think it looks really dope. And then she also got me these earrings, which are also from Dolls Kill, and they're just like keys, but they're bedazzled. That's what they look like. My, literally, my hands are so glittery. I'm triggered. The last thing that she got me, this banana, what do you call it, neon sign. I'm gonna hang it. <laughs> 
possibly there, but I feel like I'm gonna like kick it down in my sleep because I'm kind of a wild sleeper. Or over there. Mm, probably will go over there. Thank you, BBG. I love you. Last but not least is also for my mom. She got me. I said that I just wanted clothes, but she. Okay, so she said, So I'm standing in Urban Outfitters, absolutely overwhelmed, and it occurs to me that we have two choices. One, I can buy you a bunch of stuff that looks like this, and then she just did a bunch of really ugly stuff at Urban, a bunch of pictures of it. Two, I can get you a gift card and we'll all live happily ever after. Did I make the right choice? And then she said, This paper is good for one shopping spree at Urban Outfitters or the store of your choice. So I got a few things from different stores because she decided not to get me a gift card so I could like do different stores. And that was really sweet. Sweet. I actually really appreciate it because there's nothing I love more than shopping. So I actually got this sweater that I'm wearing right now. It's from Brandy Melville. I got a bunch of shit from Brandy Melville. I'll just show you all of it really fast. So I got this tank top, which I love Brandy's tank tops. I have a bunch of them, but none of them that I have have this lace detail on them, and I really love it. And I also just really love the design of the shirt. It's like two cherries that are like devils, and I was like, me. This shirt, it's another lace trim top, and it just says City of Angels, and it has a bunch of angels on it. I don't know why, but I'm like really into angels. Another thing with like a lace trim, I already have a black brandy dress, but I wanted one with lace trim. I thought that this was super cute and a little bow. I don't know. I feel like I had like undershirts like this when I was eight and I love the eight year old aesthetic. I do not know why. And then lastly from Brandy, they're inside out. So I'm literally wearing them today. I got the Danny light wash jeans. They're super cute. They fit really well. It's just annoying that they are not zip up. They're button up. Who the fuck still does that? Okay, I don't know if this is like illegal and I also can't find a top to one of them, but I got two underwear sets for Christmas. I got this Tommy yellow set. This is what the top looks like and then the bottoms. I love it. I love yellow. I got this set, which I can't find the top to. It's just the black velvet Calvin Klein set. I love this one so much. I don't know. This does not even qualify as a present. This is a motherfucking hand-me-down. August <laughs> gave me this anti-social social club hoodie that he didn't want. And he gave it to me the day after Christmas. He didn't even wrap it. He was just like, oh yeah, I forgot. I was asking you wanted this and I was going to be your Christmas present. It's okay, because he got me back into TikTok, so like, I owe him my life. Wow, I got so much stuff for Christmas. Oh my God, I'm so thankful. Thank you, mother. Literally, my dad does not pick out Christmas gifts at all. I don't know if that's how it is for your family, but my dad like has nothing to do with it. She got me this little Tatcha skincare set. I'm so excited about this because I'm not really like a huge skincare person, but when I saw this on Sephora, I was really intrigued because it said, skincare for makeup lovers and I was like it comes with the Tatcha. It's a Tatcha set, so everything's from Tatcha. It comes with the Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. Really excited about that. I've tried it a few times. The spritzer is a little weird. I don't know. Maybe it's just because I'm so used to my Morphe one, but the actual product itself is really great. And that's full size. And then this is a mini of the water cream, which I am obsessed with. I use it as my night moisturizer. It's just so thick, but then it blends in. So literally, like, it's a gel when you pick it up, but then as you start to rub it, it turns into water. I do not understand. But I love it. Um, the Silk Canvas, which I do really love. Like you had it or you're gonna buy it or something. I just suggest that like I don't know if this is just me But I just use it here and I find that my concealer like slips off sometimes So just make sure that you put powder sometimes I forget to put powder here I just normally put it under my eyes But yeah, just make sure you set the concealer that you put on top of that And then lastly it comes with a mini violet C radiance mask And I tried this once and it's really good and it's actually purple and it looks kind of silly <laughs> So I got that. Thank you. Lily lashes in the style of Miami, but get this Oh, me bitches, yes. Y'all know, my favorite lashes. I hate to be a basic bitch, and I hate to have my favorite lashes be 30 fucking dollars. I only have the like actual mink versions, because Rachel gave me an old pair of hers when I last went to Texas, and um, they're kind of crusty now. And I didn't want to buy another one, because number one, they're $30, number two, it's not cruelty free. Answers solved. Don't have to spend money, don't have to kill animals. This is literally like the best present ever. I'm so excited, I haven't worn them yet, because they're just so new. I have I haven't even taken the little sticker off. I'm so, so, you have no idea. Now I'm gonna like feel good and look good too. Like shit. This gift isn't from anybody that I know personally, but it's probably one of my favorite gifts. I'm not gonna lie. My hands are so glittery, so I'm gonna keep it in the package because I want it to retain its beautifulness, but I finally got my YouTube 100,000 plaque. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna cry, honestly. Like, I don't think you understand, and I don't think I regularly express my gratitude for my subscribers and for you guys, but I just want you to know you are literally my entire world. The reason I wake up in the morning, the reason I'm not fucking dead yet, I don't know what I would do without you, and I don't know what I would do without this channel. This channel literally just feels like what I was meant to do. It feels like this is my purpose, and even though I'm kind of shitty at it, 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this Christmas haul. I'm really sorry if it was kind of late, but I hope that I think you made up for it. I think it was a pretty entertaining video. Normally, I feel like my videos suck, but I think I, I was good in this one. So let me know what you think down below. I'm always up to hear constructive criticism. Just make sure that it's not bitchy. Like, you can give me advice on how to do things differently, but you don't have to, like, be a dick. But, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe, suck my dick, and keep on giving gifts. I gave a lot of gifts this year. I wasn't just like receiving. My favorite part of Christmas is giving gifts, but also receiving them is kind of fun too. I'm not gonna lie, but it is definitely not my favorite part of Christmas. Maybe in the top five. So don't forget where you came from. Keep giving gifts. Stay humble, bitches. Love Jesus. I love you. Bye. Tell me that I'm an idiot. You know that you'll be lying. What?